Welcome to today's edition of Crypto Corner at InvestorIdeas.com. News on what's driving the cryptocurrency market. Hey everyone, this is Sam Mowers here. Welcome to episode 866 of the Crypto Corner podcast. Crypto Corner was recently named one of 14 of the best crypto and blockchain podcasts by the site Your Oyster. That's rendered Y O R E Oyster. You can check out this list along with a write up about Crypto Corner over at youroyster.com slash blog slash best dash crypto dash podcasts. Now for news today, Coinbase has secured approval from Italian regulators. WonderFi has partnered with Meta VC Partnerships and Luxfolio has announced the launch of Immersion Mining. But just before we get into the news today, a quick reminder that if you enjoy this podcast, please feel free to share it or leave us a review. And as always, I recommend checking out some of the other podcasts on InvestorIdeas.com. This includes the Cannabis Podcast, the Clean Tech and Climate Change Podcast, along with many others, all of which will bring you up to speed on the latest stock news and trends in their respective spaces. Right, so Coinbase, which trades on the NASDAQ under the ticker COIN, has announced in a blog post that it has secured the crypto asset service provider approval from Italian regulators, allowing it to provide ongoing crypto services to its residents. The post indicates that the crypto exchange giant now serves customers across almost 40 European countries and is in the process of strengthening its presence across Europe. Nana Marugasan, the company's vice president of, of rather international and business development, said, quote, Building a constructive relationship with regulators in every jurisdiction in which we operate is incredibly important as we march toward our mission of increasing economic freedom in every corner of the world. Gaining this regulatory approval is a testament to our close collaboration and positive working relationship with the Italian financial regulators. As we continue to grow across Europe and other regions, maintaining our strong regulatory relationships will ensure that we will continue to bring to market the products that our customers want through the most trusted and secure platform in the crypto economy. End quote. Next up, WonderFi Technologies, Inc., which trades on the TSX under the ticker WNDR, has partnered with the Meta Venture Capital Partnerships team a subsidiary of Meta Platforms, Inc., which trades on the NASDAQ as META, formerly Facebook, of course. This, according to the press release, will see the latter provide WonderFi with strategic advice on growth marketing, performance, and scale of WonderFi's business, consultancy on creative strategies with other Meta departments, and guidance on privacy-focused regulations. Ben Samaru, CEO of WonderFi, said, quote, We are excited to work together with Meta as we continue to grow the WonderFi brands and offer crypto to consumers in a compliant and regulated manner. Meta will be a key partner in our growth strategies within Canada and internationally. End quote. Luxfolio Holdings, Inc., which trades on the CSE under the ticker LUXX, has announced that it has recently closed the sale of 100 petahash, or approximately 970 cryptocurrency mining machines, wherein the miners will continue to be hosted by Luxfolio under a two-year immersion hosting agreement. Now, this move reduces the company's debt by some 3.2 million USD and allows it to continue to mine Bitcoin on the overclocked petahash of the miners placed in immersion, bringing steady revenues via hosting fees. Kian Tran, Luxfolio's COO, said, quote, Our long-term outlook on Bitcoin is bullish, and we believe our decisions provide us the best opportunity to participate in the Bitcoin mining industry and secure a slice of the world's largest and most secure decentralized monetary network. We are deleveraging and locking in a mix of steady revenues while still maintaining exposure to mining. End quote. That does it for today's Crypto Corner. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. 
Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products, services, or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss in investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Apple Podcasts, Audible, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts, and most audio platforms available.